Listen up, Rangers. Welcome to the Geek Chest. My name's Steve. My name is Arnaz. And that's season two of Attack on Titan, eh? Yeah. Yeah. It's over. Sadly, like, season three won't come out to, like, 2018. But you know what? Yeah, it's official, though. Yeah. But yeah, we gotta wait for another half a year. But it's okay. <sighs> I'm pretty sure we'll still find out absolutely nothing in season three. <laughs> pretty much. Because, okay. So, today we're gonna go over season two. This might replace the movie review this week because we still haven't sat down and rewatched Hellboy. So, because it's been busy. And my, like, instead of watching when I should have, I watched WWE Money in the Bank. God, I hate you, Steve, so much. <laughs> well, I watched The Last Attack on Titan and, uh, well, there's more for My Hero Academia. Yeah. yeah Thankfully, was I was going to be so upset. I thought, so like, upset. I thought that was over. And then, like, I, you know, watched the end of it because credits came in early. I was like, oh, something cool's going to happen. No, it's just previous for next episode. I was like, oh, okay, that's cool. Yeah, I'm like, thank God. I'm like, at least get through the hero killer. Please. Get through that arc. That's all I want. No, you, that won't go that far. Like, I'm hopeful. You can't just cut it, like, when you hit it there. Then I'd be even more mad. Like, Attack on Titan. Just cut it when it's getting good. Huh. <sighs> I think the thing that helps me, though, is I haven't read the manga fully on Attack on Titan. Like, we're at the point where, like, I haven't been into it as much. Because I personally, I, I can't stand the art. No, the art. I'm for sorry, the manga. Guys. Yeah, it's just, I can't. I have a hard time with it. The animation, on the other hand, is pretty good. Uh, but yeah. So, also, recently, because of the new season, I got some pops. I have a question if anybody else also has these pops. The, the armor titan and the female titan. Does your female titan weigh like a baseball? Like, he's, like, what I expected. He's, like, hollow, vinyl, okie dokie. I'm pretty sure we could go play a game with her. She feels like solid plastic. <laughs> like, this head is, yeah, it's just solid, solid plastic. There's a ball joint there. She stands up still, so I haven't complained much, but... Yeah, if she fell, she would break something. She's on the bottom shelf. I also got an ant, too. But, yeah, so... Uh, things I liked about the season... <laughs> Uh, the animation, definitely better than the first season. Oh, they have to up a notch. The only thing is, like, I hate the Colossal Titan with CG. The Bacon Face? Yeah, Mr. Bacon Face. It's not as bad as the movie, mind you. Oh, I we still gotta buy the second part of the movie and watch and review it, Steve. Since I was a champ and bought the first one, it's only fair if you buy <laughs> the second one. <laughs> sure, I don't waste my money on that one. Yep. I feel a... bad too because the director is gonna be there at G Fest. You want to take my DVD so you can have him sign it? No. Well, do you want it signed? I'll sign. I'll get a sign for you if you want. He'll probably be thankful. <laughs> <laughs> it's like this is a pity signage. <laughs> Please. Oh, uh, because I'm getting my Shin Godzilla figure signed. I'm gonna sign by like everybody. I actually might have you sign it. You're gonna give that monstrosity to somebody. I don't I think it's like, my collection. Last year was like twenty bucks. So you can have an autographed Attack on Titan. It could be yours forever. I don't want that monstrosity in my collection. <laughs> oh. oh. Yeah, I'm sorry. I like your, I love your other works, man. But uh yeah. So animation's pretty solid. I think the story <laughs> pacing was actually pretty good, and the action sequences were really nice as well. Especially with uh, Aaron fighting the Armor Titan. Fighting Reiner. That was kind of cool. I like that. I love the whole action scene. Like, everything was good about it. Except the end, how he B-I-T-C-H's out. Which, okay, I understand what's going on. But God, I wish the anime understood what was going on. Because <laughs> it's like... Okay, the other thing that was cool was... I like the castle sequence when they're at the castle and all the Titans start forming on. Those parts are really cool. I like getting the backstory of some of these characters that you didn't really get to in the first season, which is really nice. You get to learn more about Sasha, this Miss Potato Girl. Oh, my favorite guy was that second best, you know, in the Scout region. He was amazing, and he dies in the second episode or first episode. I forget which one. <laughs> first one, I think it was. Oh, yeah. The, my favorite things, too, is, like, the deaths in this one still have, like, a lot of graviance. You think we'd be used to it by now, but they they find ways of tweaking it just to make you go, oh, like when the one girl's like yelling, "Daddy, don't!" <laughs> I, was just, I was like, oh. oh, she's had a messed up life. 
And then, oh yeah, at the end, what's his face gets eaten? Oh, their uh, guy who saved in the first. I'm time. gonna say guardian by the smiling guardian. titan. That's what they call him, the smiling titan. Yeah, when you think they're finally gonna get revenge, they're like, oh, he's got him. Aaron's gonna do it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> No, nope, no, nope, should have known. Should have known. I as soon as I seen that, I was like, he's gonna die. Can, uh, that's can, in my in my heart. I'm like, he's gonna be or like in my heart. I'm like, Aaron will save him. In my mind, I'm like, he's a goner. <laughs> Cannon was like, Aaron will save. No, honey, he won't. We all know how tight. Just look how Aaron's is ripping into his hand. It ain't happening. Still didn't even do it at the end. No, he didn't. Stupid. He, he sucked. He sicked a bunch of titans on him. This isn't even a review. This is just us bitching about it. <laughs> Pretty much. Well, because it's like, all right, well, the negatives <laughs> of the season is at the end of the first season, they introduced that the Titans make up the wall. And I know in the manga, the coordinator can pretty much make do that thing. Make Titans into, like, structures. Because that's pretty much what their goal was. Like, Aaron needs to figure out how the heck he's going to make a wall, wall of Titans. So to say, they didn't say it like that, but pretty much to go block up a hole that isn't there. But, uh, so they introduced that. They try to get some information out of the church in that one. Doesn't happen. And so you're left in the dark on what's going on with the stuff that they introduced at the end of the first season. And then, <clears throat> but they did actually, in this season, finally, like, you unveil who the armor titan was and the colossal titan, even though it's kind of anticlimactic. Like, they just go, like, hey, it's us. Join us. Which there's, like, still so many guest titans in there that we're missing. Like, why, why didn't they tell us about the other ones? Yeah, well, at least, like, they tease the beast titan. I hate that. Like, that guy sucks. Like, even in a video game, I can't pass him. That's stupid. Sad day. Well, oh. I understand that Reiner's, like, crazy, so that's kind of why he just went off and was like, hey, it's us. So, in this season, you get to learn about that, too, which is... Still very nice, and you kind of need it to where we were going. Anyways, but it's like, I kind of wish they would explain more stuff from the first season. And then there's the whole, like, what is the coordinate? Because you get a tease of it, but it's still, well, like... tells you what it actually is. They don't is. tell you what it is. What the heck your mirror's ever actually talking about? Because she keeps, like, going on about, like, how it's not safe inside the wall, it's safer outside of the wall... But, and then she knows things, but we don't know those things. And then she starts going on a tangent about those things, but we still don't know what those things actually are. She never tells <laughs> you what it is. She oh. was just a goddess at one point. Which, to, from what it seems, is that they were making people in the Titans that were getting exiled. Maybe. Again, Maybe. I haven't really read the mangas that much, so all going up on the wind here. You go let me know in the comment section below. I'm personally, I don't care about spoiler stuff. But nope. some people might. Uh, but pretty much what, like, her tangents were forever. Like, what, how his story really ties into this, because she ties into the church thing, too. Yeah, and that was, like, so stupid. She spends all that time, literally even throws herself into death to save uh, Historia. Goes through all that garbage, and at the end, she's like, I can't leave those guys behind. I know what they're going through. And, okay, what are they going through? Tell us! Why are you sacrificing yourself? Because I know they're trying to make us feel for those two characters. Like, they have it rough as well. Which is the whole reason they're trying to steal Eren in the first place. And then that whole Mikasa thing. Where oh. he's like, oh, I'm useless. Man, and then Mikasa's like, I'm going to look in your eyes, I love you, Debbie. We're going to make out. And then Eren's going to punch something instead. That was so Punching close! Aaron. <laughs> so close! She almost told him how she felt. It was right there. Like, right there. He's like, I'll always put that scarf around you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was like, you homo motherfucker. Damn it. <laughs> She's hot. I would have worded it that way. <laughs> okay. <laughs> God damn it, I have a lot of shit to cut out. It's 2017. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Oh, uh, God, it pissed me off. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm like, yay. It's like, even like, I love the setup too, because there's like flowers, but the Titan's like looking at them. And yeah. I'm like, this might actually be kind of a cool scene. And then just, oh. she, she's. It looks like she's about to die. She's going to tell him how she feels right before she does it. And. Yeah. One punch. 
I like how he stops at two. Like, I guess it's because he, like, commanded, in a Ooh. sense, so... <laughs> oh god uh, it's just that last episode like I have so many emotions which I guess it did it's job well but it pissed me off it I'm did. like well I guess I I need to see season 3 now stupid <sighs> like the first season like I understood everything that was going on they had some stuff that was a mystery <clears throat> but that's what made it kind of cool this one it was just too many M. <laughs> M. Night Shyamalan twists and mysteries I don't even know about and then a twist that just come out of freaking nowhere. Like I like I knew that it was Reiner and uh, uh I forget how to forget his name. Because of the B. It's like Burnbull something. Bacon face. <laughs> Whatever, Mr. Bacon Face. I knew it was them, but I I didn't know the Amir one. That kinda came out of nowhere. Yeah, I didn't know that one. I knew them too. I know there's what, one more Titan in there technically that's hiding, I think. Uh I do believe. Yeah. And then there's the Beast Titan. Those are the ones I know. Yeah, but the Beast Titan's somebody else. And... Though then again, it might have just been Ymir. Was the one I was thinking, well, like the random one I never really paid much attention to. It might have been. Maybe. But yeah, uh, for season three <laughs> entirely, I'm satisfied with the season. Like, it was definitely still visually fun to watch. It's just, I wish they maybe could have like tossed in a little bit more explanation or maybe even just expanded the season out a little more. Because I know what they're trying to do. They're trying to make us, you know, wait for season three or whatever, but that that's not... they give you more of a reason to actually invest into another we're season. Still, if we're in a second season, damn it, we're going to watch a third season. Stop messing with us. Seriously. I don't know. It could be, like, Supernatural. I get that show seven seasons of my life. <laughs> and then it was just like, eh, can't do it. Can't do it. I might start watching again. I, I haven't, sh- I haven't I seen should. a new season. Like, I enjoy season. it, but... I haven't seen a new season, but I know their dad is coming back in a new season, so. Again? Oh, he never, he died in the second season, never came back. But you still see him periodically. No. Like, you see him once as a ghost in one of the episodes or something like that. In, like, season five, when they open the gate of hell, but you don't see him again. Yeah, but it was just, still. I like like all they do is retread everything. That's not like true. the one season I was watching Jessica watch. Like they're already back to dealing with like God and angels and stuff again. I'm like, that's not true. They're retrending. They're retrends of retrending. And there was like like Satan's cage. They were already like, oh, that's a thing again. And it's just like, yeah, I, I think you move about... on. New stuff. Just hunt monsters. It's all I want. First season was awesome when they were just hunting stuff. Second season was cool because they introduced a bunch of new stuff. And then it was just like, and then we were stuck there for a little bit, but I was okay with it. And then we went back to the monsters briefly. It was new monsters, but they're still kind of the same setup as the Angels and Demons. And then we were just back. <laughs> I just want to watch show about them killing monsters. Please. Please. Wait, wait, what are we talking about? Because my favorite thing about Supernatural is like the rain of episodes. Like the one where they're like stuck in like the television loop. <laughs> Stuff like that. Like those episodes are awesome. Or where they go like to convention. I love those or when ones. Dean dies like 300 times. Those are <laughs> they're like they can't kill him well, okay I guess they can huh <laughs> but yeah if you guys haven't watched season 2 of Attack on Titan we, we're kind of rude for it <laughs> but it's go okay. watch it it's go still it. like if you like the first season you're going to enjoy the second season it's a given yeah. uh, but I feel like if like you didn't like the first season this is, this is not going to help you at all and if anything it's just going to make things even more complicated <laughs> it's going to piss you off more Trust me. But yeah. But <laughs> definitely as fans of the animated series anyways, I really had a good time watching it. But yeah. What would you guys think of Attack on Titan? Please let us know in the comment section below. And help us defeat those kaijus by hitting that like button. Subscribe, become a ranger today. And see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.